Hello gamers, this is EGR Gamer, and I've been mining, as I said I would do that off camera so you guys aren't bored, and I found some iron, so let's go ahead and mine this, oh, we just hit the mother load, hit the jackpot, we just hit the jackpot, that's, wow, yeah. oh, eight iron, that's nice, so, what I'm going to do is now, I'm going to go make an iron pickaxe. This is the best way to go find diamond. So, I'm hopefully trying to find diamond right now. Hopefully, we'll be able to find it in this episode. Uh, forgot to set my timer again. Um, okay. So, yeah, definitely going to go make an iron pickaxe. Um, I'm not sure. Do I have any bread with me? No, I don't. As you guys remember last time it was night time when we first started and yeah it's daytime i've been mining so much so it took that long to get to daylight for me to come all the way down here to get all this and i haven't found coal yet so what i had to do was i had to make right here where they right here torches these are charcoal torches they're not even real torches so now we have enough to make that's an iron pickaxe. So hopefully we can find diamond. It should I don't think I'm that far. It shouldn't take that long really, with my luck. It really wouldn't take shouldn't take that long to find diamond. I'm really lucky at finding diamond, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna continue on from here. Continue mining down. So what we're going to do, keep mining down. I'm very excited to find some diamonds. Okay. Well, we're just going to have to. Oh, wow. Alright, what we're going to do is... Oh, why'd I do that? Why? I don't know. There we go. Oh, looky. Whoa, what is that? Are you kidding me? Oh. Lava? Yeah. Lava. Oh, whoa. And we found some gold. Oh, what am I doing? Like I said, iron pickaxes. I mean, stone pickaxes cannot mine that gold. But iron pickaxes can. Oh no, I'm losing it. Wow, we hit the mother load of gold. Alright, so it's a little risky. But Pretty deep lava. When you're in a situation like this, you wanna just build out. Around the diamond, so, oh, not like that. Crouch so that you don't accidentally walk off the edge. And lose all your stuff. Oh, wow. Yes, we hit the mother load of diamond too. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I'm happy now. Oh, like, like I said, with my luck, we'll run into diamond. And wow. Definitely with my luck, we ran into a lot of diamond. Alright. So, 
Looks like we have no need to, to mine right now. So what we're going to do is uh, come back up here. And I have I should have enough to make a diamond pickaxe and a diamond sword. It's really all you really need, but you don't really need a diamond sword just because I have enough iron to make an iron sword, which doesn't last as long as a diamond sword, but it takes the same amount of hits as a diamond sword. So I could just keep making diamond pickaxes instead of doing all that other stuff. You, you really don't need a diamond sword unless you're versing other players. With other mobs, yeah, you really don't need it. But we have five diamonds, so we can go ahead and we need more sticks. Make a diamond pickaxe and... This makes mining a lot faster. Um, see, I will have enough for sword and sword and uh, there's something else I wanted to make. Oh yeah, shears. So let's go ahead for the sword. Oh, I made a stone sword by accident and some shears. Okay, so with these shears, we need a bed. Bed or a necessity. Got a cow. Okay, let's hopefully we can find a sheep somewhere out here. Usually I run into them a lot, but Lord knows. Oh, sheepy, sheepy, sheepies. Just getting a good source of food as I'm going out here to look for some. Looking for some uh, sheep. Now, a good thing about the new updates and stuff with this is that animals now spawn. You're not limited animals, so these things will spawn. And we have a sheep. Alright, now we have enough for a bed. Go back to the village. I could have stole some of so that wool right there, that wool block up there, but, uh, you know me, I'm adventurous. Give me some more leather. Alright. Okay, uh, hunger is going down from running. I have a good source of food, so it doesn't really matter. I'm, I'm a little upset, though. I haven't ran into any coal yet. Especially mining, I, that's the first thing I usually get. The first thing I got was iron, which is pretty shocking to me because I never run into iron so fast. So, um, oh, I need wooden planks, don't I? O M G. Oh, duh. Never mind. I forgot the rest of my wool right here. cooking we'll go ahead and it's essential to keep your food up so help them out with their see do I have any redirected no, so we'll just do that there we go. and the way to not break the ground is to uh, crouch walk on it. So 
if you crouch, you won't break the, you won't until the ground. So, and for you guys that don't know when the wheat's done, it's the highest level that it is right now, like this. It's like this color. It's ready to be uh, harvest. It has three levels. Well, honestly, I think it's four. Not nah, three. First, this is the first one. Second one. No, first, second, third, and fourth. I believe this has four stages actually. And look at it, it's already becoming nighttime already. This fast? No. Oh, let me replant these seeds so we can get more. I did see a cave over here. And we got more iron. So let's get that with the stone pickaxe. Cause I don't want to waste my uh, iron or diamond one. And you're like, well no, you got more iron, but I could use the iron for anything else. Nah, it's not really a cave system. Oh my gosh, yes. Cold, 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 cold. Found some coal. Um, I've been thinking if I went an above ground house or or a house under under the ground, I'll show you guys how to survive like that. Um, if you guys want to uh, I want you guys to comment down below if you guys want me to either build a house above ground or build a house underground or do both. Build a house above and underground. And we got a zombie. Get some XP. We got a creeper over there. We could use some gunpowder. So let's go ahead attack this creeper. Uh, oh. Creepers blow up. <laughs> you guys already knew that. Let's get these. Best way to attack these is wait for them to jump at you. Use some string. Because this is another source of food. Back up. Back up. Back up. There's some string right there. Keep a good distance away from them. That way, they don't attack you while just walking into you. Um, go ahead and get some more wool. And sheep, they they need um, they need grass in order to grow back their their wool. So you'll see them. Um, you'll hear it, and then um. If you look down, the, the grass will be gone from the grass block and just look at look like a, a dirt block. Now, in order to get sheep to grow the wool underground, you have to have a light source because grass won't grow on dirt unless there's light. You have to have sunlight shining on it. If not, there will not be any um, grass. Therefore, there won't be any... Uh, the sheep won't give any wool. So it's a helpful hint out there for you guys. See this one already grew back to stuff. Take it, take it again. You could use you could use wool for like carpeting and just making making your home look pretty nice. So I think I'm gonna also collect more more of this wool. Yeah, keep your distance from these guys if you, if you really want the drops because. They will blow up if you get too close. And then you won't get anything. So keep your distance. See, like I didn't keep my distance. I'll get this dirt because I can use it for a farm. Oh. Pretty much since I found diamond in this area, I think I'm going to 